City could open their plant in Buffalo earlier than we previously thought. News 4's Dave Graber joins me live. Dave, what's the latest? Well, Annalena, the latest earnings report released this week for Solar City's parent company, Tesla, shows increasing losses on increasing sales, but strengthening the company's bottom line, well, that should actually pay off for production at the massive plant going up in South Buffalo. Now, those were among the revelations that came from Tesla's quarterly report that was released yesterday. Perhaps the biggest local news that came from the call with investors and then the subsequent report is that the production facility in South Buffalo will open, quote, soon after the month of June. That's when Solar City is expected to begin production at its first gigawatt plant in Fremont, California. Tesla's top brass said in a letter to shareholders yesterday they will selectively deploy solar projects that are sure to make money rather than starting up production at any cost and at any time. Today I talked with economics and finance expert Fred Floss about how Tesla's work in the car manufacturing world will help solar panel production here in New York. We should expect it to be a little bit bumpy. It's hard to merge two companies together and then have a major deal with a third large company and get all of that worked out. So it wouldn't surprise me over the next year or year and a half that we see a bumpy road till everybody figures out how this is going to work. Now, the companies he's referring to are parent company Tesla taking over Solar City and having Panasonic as a partner to help boost its bottom line and ensure there's enough money to keep the project afloat. Now, Tesla took over Solar City in November, and this is the first quarterly report issued with the company, the solar company, under its wing. Now, the plant is expected to open this summer with full production expected by the end of the year here in Western New York. Reporting live in the newsroom, Dave Graber, News 4 at 530.